This is Uru Park. Hey guys, Dennis here. I hope you're doing good from wherever it is you're watching. Welcome to my channel if this is your first time here. If not, then hey, Mikasa is Sukasa. What can I say except you're welcome? Anyway, today is Sunday, the 1st of November, and the plan for today is to head out and catch up with a friend. We haven't met for a few months, so I just wanted to catch up and talk. And she said, why not? And I felt I'd take you guys along. Her name is Flo, you guys will meet her later on. So that's the plan for today. So we are going to head out and meet with Flo. But before we do that, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, I do my best to make videos. I call them feel good videos. So if that's your cup of tea, then take a detour to the subscribe button. Also at any time during this video, if you have the time and you do that sort of thing, don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. Anyway, enough said, let's head out, meet up with Flo and do a picnic oh oh ah. right so guys this is what happened i called up flo and she decided that instead of meeting up and taking a matatu together we just meet up at the destination i think that is reasonable so we decided to meet up at central park and i'm already here it's like i arrived before she arrived so i'm just waiting for her to turn up and in the meantime i think i can show you guys what central park looks like been like three to four months eh? three to four months it's been yeah. forever three to four months since we last met so this is our campango for sunday just catch up and speak about talk about everything and everything everything and anything i'm money everything and everything i don't want to scare you man a dry spell man a decent guy like you know the one i'm dating like a, a man who actually knows how to treat a woman. How? You make it sound so interesting. Well, not everyone. Connie, I'm not decent. You, you, you're, you're my friend. Like, you're my BFF. That's a scare, so that's a <laughs> Of course, you're my BFF. And, and you're one of the decent guys I know. Cindy, you know, you know what I normally say? A relationship is not about me 100%. So, if I don't have anything to offer, I'd rather just keep out, yeah? You see now? Baby, you saying you'd rather have something to offer. What do you mean something to offer? Are you talking about money, Emma? Of course, money facilitates a relationship. And the onus of that is, it's the guy's money. That has always been the traditional way that it goes. If a lady is financing a relationship, the society makes it look weird. The guy has to facilitate a relationship with his money. Okay? He has to be in a position to facilitate the relationship with his money. That is how it is. That is how it has always been. So... But should, should relationships be about money, honestly? It shouldn't be, but it is. You know, you cannot bring idealism into relationships. First impressions matter, yeah? And when you meet someone for the first time, you don't know their personality, you don't know their strength, their talents, all that, yeah? That comes later, and that is facilitated by meeting in restaurants and having conversations and going out because you're not married you don't live together that is the only scenario where you'd get to know somebody what if uh, you don't have to go to the restaurants and stuff and you where do you meet cheap places on, like, like like here later yeah, like later like, uh, mm. they're having fun right they're having fun now that is the problem right there yeah there are good girls out here that know that a relationship should not be based on money the only problem is there are no billboards that Manambazawzimandikwa. It's a case of probability. But at the same time you attract what you are. You attract what you are? What do you mean? Yeah. Like legit, you attract what you are within. Mm. Like uh, the kind of people who are in your life, mm. you actually attracted them, you yourself. Yes, like you you have the power to do that. You didn't know, like, uh, like for example, you and I, mm. us being friends, it's not a coincidence. No, we it is. Each other. We did not attract each other. <laughs> this is what happened. <laughs> Let me tell you guys what happened. 
I commented on your blog post. She she had a blog back then, a very nice one. Okay. I commented on that blog post. She said, "Ah, oh, who's this guy that's commenting on the blog post? Is, is there any happenstance?" But the thing is, like, um, the fact that we actually had some stuff in common. That's Changiad. You have to agree. A little bit. A little really? bit. Your lover is not your friend. Actually, you can have both. No, 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 no. Oh, geez, okay. That is why friends last longer than lovers. Lovers break up and then but, but the they best go separate ways. The best relationship is relationship is where couples are friends. They interact as friends. They think they are friends. Oh, Jesus. They are not. Let, let me tell you the function of love and, and, and intimacy. No? Mm. It's for people to <laughs> be together and help each other and have companionship. Those people are not friends. Oh, they have a mutual interest. Like when I feel cold at night, you'll be spreading your legs. Ew, and you will. <laughs> how would you even say that? Okay. No, that is what happens. Now they are looking. No, let me tell you. They are looking for something to to like wrap it around. Like they need something to like put it inside. So they say we are best friends because this person makes me breakfast and they are always there. I talk to them and at night I don't feel any cold. And we are always hang around with them and we watch movies, Netflix and chill. Okay? <laughs> they are not friends. They are together for a particular reason. Like, I'm so lonely. I need somebody to be here. I don't want to feel so cold anymore. And we, we should have other things that put us together. Sometimes at night I also have one to people to sp <laughs> spread their legs. <laughs> Okay, so I didn't just say this is not the love in my heart, you're so messed up. No, I'm not. You're messed up. <laughs> you see now, so people now bring friendship into that. Like, ah, this is my friend. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Let me tell you why. Your lover is not your friend. Yeah? As soon as you love somebody else, you break up. But you can have as many but friends as you want without let me let, let me finish you can have like one best friend and make another friend but your friend won't feel offended saying, not friendship all i'm saying is if you can actually your lover can still be your best friend that is what i'm saying i uh, don't really believe what you say the best relationships are founded when people are friends to be that's what i'm saying <laughs> <laughs> I'm so short, right? <laughs> Me and Flo have finished our car picnic. We've decided to take uh, pictures, pictures. Your Flo is an amateur. I do yeah. a picture. Seriously? But uh, I'm hoping that uh, yeah. kidogo kidogo, a few shenanigans, then she'll take very nice pictures. So what I'm going to be doing now is I'll be showing you those pictures in like a car. What do we call it? Sequence, eh? In a sequence of, it, it will be a sequence of pictures, yeah? So let's see what pictures the amateur Flo can take. And what pictures oh, yours truly really? eh, can take and we be of course the pictures she has taken will be pictures of me and pictures i've taken will be pictures of her so that's how you guys will be able to judge let me know down in the comment section which 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 person takes better pictures i mean definitely i'm going to take better Cindy. pictures as i now match up So guys, we are in Uhuru Park. I suggested to Flo that we take pictures in Central Park, but then what she did is she told me that Uhuru Park has better scenes. And so we've come to Uhuru Park, and we just want to see the kind of images we can get. Eh? Yeah. Flo is very short, so you guys, you guys will be struggling to see her. So I have to like. So guys, even as we are taking pictures of us, I thought it'd be nice, it'd be nice to take pictures of the scene as well. So I'm, I'm including shots of Uru Park as well, the scenes, the people, the sounds, and uh, Flo is taking really bad pictures of me. So <laughs> you guys will be the judge of that. Just let me know in the comment section if Flo is doing a good job or a terrible job. But this is Uru Park.
guys so that's a wrap that's that's been our picnic with Flo so if you like the video don't forget to give the video a thumbs up <laughs> if you haven't subscribed to the channel take a detour to the subscribe button and subscribe to the channel as always thank you for watching I'll be seeing you on the next Bye. Flo.